I'm here with Cougar men's soccer assistant Brendan Mullane. Cougars coming off a one and one conference week, taking down Benedictine two to one on Wednesday, and then taking a loss to Rockford on Saturday afternoon. Coach, if you could give us a little insight about how your team performed this week. Yeah, the season's been, it's been an up and down season, and this week really, really defined that. Uh, Benedictine is a very strong team, uh, conference champions in the past, and uh, we played this game with emotion, with heart, and they went out there and they, uh, they took a 1-0 lead, which was nice, and we could have got a chance. Uh, we had a penalty kick that could have made it 2-0, but we missed, and it was nice to see the team still stay in the game and uh, play for 90 minutes with heart against a very, very strong team. And then going into Rockford was uh, the team wasn't prepared mentally, and when you're not prepared mentally, you're not going to show up physically, and that's exactly what happened. And um, we really got caught off guard and uh, ended up, unfortunately, with the loss. Talking more about that Benedictine game, you've, you were a part of the soccer program here for years. What kind of thing did that mean to you, to this program, to be able to take down a conference power like that? Yeah, it meant a lot. Um, last year we had a chance to win it, and um, unfortunately a couple shots didn't go our way. And um, this year it was really nice to get the lead and say, all right, we're in this, let's try to keep this lead. And then... Um, move from move on from there and it was really nice to watch the whole team work together the whole bench get up and uh support their team and um it was it was uh really nice to watch uh for 90 minutes looking forward to this week cougars have three matches left in the season two of those being this week first of those being wednesday at, at aurora university and then sunday coming home to face arch rival Concordia University, Wisconsin. Coming off that tough loss and that high of highs this week, how do you guys in training get the team back up, get it motivated to take on some of the key teams in conference? Yeah, you know, we started bright and early this morning with training, and uh, we said we, you have to forget about it. You have to move on. You have to keep going. We can't dwell on it because then it's just going to be stuck in our heads. So we got out there this morning. We worked. Uh, it, was, it was a nice training session. Um, everyone seemed connected, seemed focused, and it, that was nice for once. Uh, instead of some people lagging or still talking about the loss, everyone kind of forgot about it. We moved on, and uh, we're looking forward to Aurora on Wednesday, which should be a big game. Awesome, Coach. Well, good luck this week in your final matches of the season, and look forward to talking to you or head coach Michael Bindorf on Monday. Thank you.